and know that there are snakes and there are black widows out here. So I want to not be stupid. Well, I just got here and I am getting ready to camp for two nights here in my car. We are planning on doing all of our water line and trenching for our electric in the next two days. We have so much work. It, as you can maybe see, it's still raining right now if you can hear it. So we have been fighting the rain ever since we got this place cleared out. It's a bummer that the timing just didn't work out for us. It's nice and cool, which is good, but it is wet. Everything's wet and drenching and wetness doesn't really mix. So I wanna be able to get as much done while I'm here. The good thing is I have the weather to be able, it's, it's not that hot and it's kind of nice and cool. But what I do have to deal with is trying to film while it is raining. That's not all that easy to do that. Cameras and, and rain do not mix. First step is I need to get the stuff out of our car. By the way, we got a new car. I'll show you that uh, later. New car, new to us car, not an actual new car. So what I need to do is be able to get the gear that's in our car out, but I need to keep it dry, which means I need to keep it out of all the mud. The good... What kind of spider that is over there? Looks like a normal one, but it looks very, very big. I'm learning about being outdoors and wanting to be cautious and know that there are snakes and there are black widows out here. So I want to not be stupid. Give me a stick. And of course, all this corrugated roofing is from the rabbit hutch. I should have taken that out. Thank you, Green Building Technologies, for this very heavy and awkward pipe. I'm not griping at all. This is so awesome. Water. Yeah. Okay, so the next thing that I have got to do is I have to cover this. You don't want your PEX pipe to be exposed to the sun. So I have a tarp in there that I'm going to be putting over all of this and all of my gear anyway, so that we get it out of the sunlight and out of the rain. Come tomorrow, this is gonna be buried in 18 inches of dirt anyway, so it's not gonna be exposed to the sun at all. Alrighty, so I have set up a little camp, just the table over there, and uh, had a quick lunch. It's raining. 
I've wasted too much time just trying to get set up here that I really gotta get some work done. Basically what I gotta do, I'll I have got to clear two things. I've gotta clear 18 feet clearance here for the house to come in. That is a lot. Uh, so I gotta get all this stuff cleared out. And from clearing all that out, I also have to clear a laneway from, don't know if you can see it. You can see that line right there. It, there's a cape, there's an electric line right there. My pole's right behind that tree. So I gotta clear all this all the way through. Because coming through here is where we are going to trench in the next two days. Gotta get all of this cleared up. So probably I gotta take this tree down. Uh, that's gonna be a whole lot of work. But basically I gotta clear all this out and I gotta do it before the rain starts coming down. Basically land clearing with a chainsaw, it's, it's just a lot of this. And then a lot of this too. Now, for sure.